So hey guys, I just wanted to show you how you can put the workflow code into your own workflow so that you have access to the workflow. What we first will have to do is we have to click on this little thing here on the JSON document, double click that and then click open. Sorry that it's German, but I, I don't know how to change that. Then you just uh, select editor in this case, and then that will open the text editor. Here we can just quickly, um, here you see the entire workflow code. What you have to do now is you have to click here on file and then save in or however, it, whatever it is in English. And then let's say you just, um, let me save this real quick. You just select this here, whatever, wherever you want to store it and then just store it in here. And now what we will do is we can close the document and we can open our NA then right here. And once you're here in like your normal thing, I have a few workflows here, of course, because I use NA then for work. But um, what you want to do now is you want to click create workflow. You can then, of course, give it a name by double clicking up here and add tags that just doesn't really do anything. What we have to do now is click these three dots here and then click import from file. And then it will open a window where you can select the file that we just uh, saved in our, in our uh, here in this yellow thing. I don't know the word for it right now, but you click this, double click it, and it will simply here. Here you have the workflow, the entire workflow built for you. We'll still have to like select credentials here, but I will show you that in the next video that was just this quick one.